Hi everyone, hope you're okay. Just thought I'd do a quick video commenting on what's happening in the news with Prince Harry on how he's revealed his struggles with his mental health. First of all, congratulations Harry. Really, I'm really, really proud of you and how you've turned out. His revelation has touched me on so many different levels. First of all, he's opened up to the whole world about his vulnerabilities and that is not an easy thing to do. And I'm so glad his brother was able to support him. I'm so his brother was, I'm really happy that his brother was so patient and so kind and so nurturing of him that he would guide him too. And that Harry listened to him as well. I mean, because I lost the parents myself at a very young age and I could and I could relate to what some of what Prince Harry said obviously I don't know his experience and um, we all have our different experiences of what happened but I could relate to especially when he said he stuck his head in the sand and um, for a long time and he felt he needed to just get on with it and but you can't do that, you just can't. It's quite normal when you lose someone to stick your head in the sand and to be in denial because you're in total shock, you're in total shock. So he, he basically was in shock for 20 years until he listened to um, his advisors, he listened to his brother and he took the step, brave step he made a choice to go for counselling and, and I suspect he had so much to deal with not just about his losing his mum which by the way I just remember um, watching how doting how, how loving how nurturing she was to her boys she worshipped the ground they, walk, they walked on she loved her children and that's what we all liked and loved about Diana how she treated her children and um, and for her sons to lose her suddenly and all the stuff that came in the media about her and Charles and her dead dad you know you just kind of admire these boys they had so much to deal with and they didn't have to and and they didn't it didn't have to go to therapy he chose to go to therapy and to deal with it in the right way so hopefully that will be an inspiration for a lot of people to realize that you don't have to carry your pain forever there is a way of dealing with there is a way of dealing with it and this there is a way forward thanks for watching and i hope you find that useful as usual don't forget to subscribe if you're new to this channel and to like my video and i'll see you soon